tireless, uh, tireless uh, worker in the field of education and bringing different cultures and societies together. Please. My name is Eli Rabinowitz. I live in Perth, Australia, and I'm a Litvak. I was born in Cape Town, South Africa, and my heritage is firmly rooted in this region. Okay. I have visited Lithuania each year since 2011, this being my eighth visit. In 1811, my third great-grandfather, Zalman Sorib Salomon, was one of the first to leave Lithuania for Jerusalem where he successfully established the Litvak community in the old city. Litvaks were resilient and achieved great successes, and members of my Salomon family founded the town of Petach Tikva, the first Hebrew newspaper, the Chuva Synagogue, and Teba Pharmaceuticals. Many Litvaks later migrated to South Africa, aptly named the Golden Medina, Jewish life in the small South African towns often mirrored the Litvak shtetl. Many of these migrants and their families were happy, successful and safe in their new surroundings. We often heard stories from their Haim describing the rich Jewish cultural life throughout Lithuania, which existed over many centuries. Those Litvaks who left Lithuania before the Holocaust were indeed lucky. More than 95% of the Lithuanian Jews were murdered in the Holocaust, a greater percentage than any other country. So why do I return to, from the Litvak diaspora to reconnect with my roots? It is my journey of discovery to understand my family in the context of Jewish cultural history and the history of the region. By being here, I'm able to experience the traces of memory firsthand and to find some remnants, clues as to how the Litvaks lived. I share these on my blog and on the 35 Lithuanian shtetl websites I write and manage. I also work with high schools in Kadani, Kalvaria and Vilnius to teach students about Jewish cultural history and the Holocaust from the Jewish perspective and I then lead collaborative classes for these schools and students around the globe. I'm expanding this to more schools in Lithuania. A growing number of articles and books have been written about family stories and Jewish life in the shtetl. This is to keep alive stories that would otherwise be forgotten. I participate in this activity as well as lecture at international conferences. All these elements come together when this wonderful museum opens. It is located right in the heartland of Litvak world, of Litvaks I have described as well as their descendants. In the future, when we visit this museum, we will be able to access the past with a better understanding of history. We will view the collection of objects and artifacts, giving us an insight into how our ancestors lived their cultural, religious, work and home lives. We will learn about their values from their daily lives and from the items they kept and used. The museum will showcase the richness and importance of Litvak shtetl life of years gone by. It will also reflect on the Jewish world that was destroyed by the Holocaust. The museum will educate Lithuanians and visitors to, edu to Lithuania and so provide an opportunity to learn from our history and strive for a better world. This museum will be a beacon of preservation and attract many in the Litvak diaspora to come and visit Lithuania and their shtetls, and like me, to reconnect with their heritage. Finally, this museum is a most appropriate way to honor the memory of the members of our families who were born, lived, and died here. And in the words of Hirsch Glick, a young poet who lived in the Vilna ghetto. Zog nit kein mol, as the gates the nesten weg. Never say that you reach the end of the road. Mir seine door, we are here. And in essence, what this says is, although it looks like the last minutes 
of the life of the Jewish people. It is not. And where the blood was shed will begin a new, a heroic and wonderful Jewish life. Thank you very much.